Well, hello. God bless you. Bishop Patrick L. Wooden Sr. here. Got a little different setup today. I hope you like it. Listen, I'm so excited. As a matter of fact, I'm just downright giddy today. Uh, and you may, you want to know, you may want to know what I'm so excited about. Well, I'm going to tell you. Tonight is the first night of the Women's Weekend that will take place this weekend, this Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, right here at the Upper Room Church of God in Christ. And I want to give a great big shout out, a great big congratulations to my lovely wife, Pamela, and the women's department of our church for this tremendous weekend that we're about to go into. Now, listen. Do you not know that they have asked me, yours truly, to be the guest speaker tonight? So all the way from Raleigh, North Carolina, <laughs> the pastor of the Upper Room Church of God in Christ, who basically preach and teach every Thursday night, will be the speaker tonight. And God has given me a word for tonight, and I'm excited about it. I'm excited about delivering the word, and I pray that you, my friends, my brothers and sisters who are watching, will come out tonight and be a part of this tremendous move of God. As as you know, the, the theme scripture, Psalms 29 and 2, give unto the Lord the glory due to his name and worship the Lord in the beauty of holiness. We are indeed a holiness church and we love worshiping God and serving the God of the Bible in the beauty of holiness. And we're going to talk about that. It's going to be tremendous. I'm excited about evangelist Vandalin Kennedy coming back to be with us. She's going to deliver the word of the Lord on Friday night and on Sunday morning. Prophetess Latara Tillman Oh, I got a chance to meet her not too long ago. What a tremendous woman of God she is. What a tremendous woman of God these women are. They are going to, to uh, she's going to be preaching Sunday morning. They're going to be a part of this great women's weekend. There is a lineup of women that are going to be used, pastors, wives, first ladies coming from near and far. And there's just so much going on. So I want you to join me tonight right here at the Upper Room Church of God in Christ. And you know, we're in a day now where there's just, just so many things going on in the world of women. We got fake women out there entering into athletic competitions and there's an uproar over that, you know, men claiming to be women. Who would have thought anything would, like this would happen? Uh, we, we've had uh, 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 our newest Supreme Court justice decline to give a definition of a woman, which I would have thought any woman would have just jumped on that. E Listen, even if it may sound like a political trap, you don't pass on an opportunity like that, especially in a time where they're trying to redefine women. We're in a day now where women are being in courage to go to the polls and vote and to participate in the political process, which you should. But isn't it amazing that there are those who are using as a motivation to, of all things, abortion. Of all things, abortion, and they're lying to you. They're calling it women's reproductive health. And if I've said it once, I've said it a thousand times, there is no reproduction in abortion. Just the opposite takes, uh, takes place. And if they meant it, if it was true, if, if their motives were good, they would at least tell you the truth. So we're, we're in a odd time, but I thank God for the women of the upper room. And you know, we've just come through where we stood and defended the, the honor, the integrity of the women of the body of Christ as, uh, that wicked song, uh, church girls was released, uh, that had nothing to do 
with good church girls. To God be the glory. So tonight I'm excited. I'm excited about the women's weekend. I'm grateful uh, to God for my lovely wife, Pamela. She's doing a tremendous job. And women of God, I want you to know that you are near and dear to her heart. She loves this work. And I'm just simply amazed with uh, how God uses her and what the women uh, of God uh, under her leadership have put together for this weekend. You don't want to miss a class. You don't want to miss a presentation. You don't want to miss a moment starting tonight. So join us here at the Upper Room Church of God in Christ for got something a little different this time women's weekend 2022 right here god's going to move good things are going to happen and and uh, i'm going to preach tonight and i want you to come out and say amen God bless you. If you can't be here, join us on this medium, Facebook Live, YouTube Live. We're going to be streaming. The word of God is going to go forth. Now you go out and make it a fantastic day. May God's choice blessings be yours.